Hi, welcome to another video. Um, today I'm working on the RS Coupe and what I'm going to be doing on this video is uh, just hammer wrapping the uh, wheel arch here. So where traditionally a lot of uh, coach builders would use a wire edge with the aluminum tube buck that I use on my cars, um, I prefer to hammer wrap the fender around that and then uh, weld it to the tube buck itself. Create First thing I'm going to do is just anneal this edge. Uh, by annealing the edge, I'll be softening the metal up and it just makes it a lot easier to form it around that tube. So the next step in this process is just to make sure that we have just the right amount of material on the wheel arch to be able to hammer form it around. And to do this, I use my uh, tube buck under here as a guide and I can just take and draw a line. Now I've already got this fender trimmed exactly where I want it. So there's a little bit of extra here that can get pulled off. So we've got the lip of this uh, wheel arch all annealed and now I'm going to come through and I'm going to clamp this. And now what I'm going to do is just use that buck to start setting my edge in. And I just do this with the simple pair of adjustable channel ox pliers just like that and I go every couple inches like that you can see how nicely this forms once it's annealed and once you get that crease set in you have a good point to to kind of uh, hammer from as well So now I've got the edge here um, creased pretty much the whole way around. I'm going to grab some ear protection and then we'll go ahead and start to hammer form the rest of it up. Okay, so that's forming really nicely for me. I'm going to pop this clamp off because I like what I'm seeing. And we'll work away right through that clamp. But you can see it's just a really simple way to get a nice clean uh, line. So let's take a look at the inside of this uh, roll where we've wrapped this around. You can see the aluminum reaches just about perfectly halfway across that half inch tube. And that's where I'm going to come through and just lace a weld all the way along that uh, fender roll. Alright, we're all set to go ahead and weld. So what we've got on the car, this is 063-3003 aluminum. Um, it is half inch aluminum tubing and then I'm using 1100 filler rod. So Here's a look at the fender after I've come back and uh, cleaned up the weld where the fender meets the body here. And then also just touched up around the wheel arch. 